This is Adam Gorney, Rivals.com, here with the 2024 new five-star rankings featuring Mike Matthews, who is uh, who was highly rated to begin with. But, you know, after the start of your junior year and the summer that you had, um, definitely now a five-star. What does that mean to you, if anything, and just kind of motivation for moving forward here? Uh, it's really just, yeah, like you said, just motivation, just work to be better and see how much I would improve from what I used to be. And it's just, it's just glad to be, you know, ranked as a five-star. We list you as an athlete, and I, I think that's fair, but you definitely play wide receiver, D-back. Is there a preference? Is there is there one that you prefer over the other, want to play in college? You kind of open to both ways. Yeah, I'm open to both ways. I really like playing wide receiver and safety, so which, wherever I'm needed at. Yeah. Uh, not a top list yet or anything, but some schools are definitely starting to formulate in your mind of of, of ones that are standing out. Some in the Southeast, some, some not. Uh, let's talk about the Southeast schools first. Clemson has been a – has been a school that's been kind of tagged to early on here, fairly or unfairly. What what do you think of them? Kind of what are your thoughts on Clemson and why they stand out so much to you? Uh, I probably think they stand out because, you know, just the school in general, how they just bring their players up as players and and as like career wise, how they are as a person, how they want people to be in their future. I, I like how they do that. And yeah, I feel like that's really important into being a man. And then Georgia and Alabama. Obviously, no surprise for an elite player in the Southeast to like those. What What are kind of the differences that you like about each, and how do they kind of stand in your recruitment now? Uh, both of the schools, really great schools, really great programs. You know, they're just, you know, known for being great. And I really like that, you know, great schools make great players. So I'm really interested in that. Yeah. Being – Liking both of those schools, has that always been kind of a lifelong thing being in Georgia, or is that just kind of has that kind of progressed as you've uh, as you as you've kind of gone through your recruitment and stuff? Yes, yeah, it's, it's I've always liked just southeastern schools. It's always been you know on TV. That's all you really see just Georgia, Alabama, and schools like that. And I always got to see see how they play, and I always liked it. Two other schools that you're that you want to visit. Those three you're going to definitely want to visit. Two others that you're looking at: Notre Dame. Another school that's really been kind of, you know, put high on the list early on, and then Ohio State. What do you like about both? And there are definitely differences there in each. Uh, what I like about Notre Dame is that they had faith in me. They was, I think, they were my first like big offer, and I liked how school believes me. You know, before everything else has gone on, I like that about them. And you said Ohio State, right? Yeah. Yeah, Ohio State. They came with my practices, and I was talking to Coach Eliano. He really just had a good impression on me. How he he just wants to work, has a wants to build me as a player, and I really like how you did that. Are you anywhere near decision time? Are you kind of pushing that off, not really worried about it through your junior year? How do you kind of think of that? Yeah, I'm not I'm not really concerned about it right now. I mean, it's still in my head, but you know, I'm just focused on the season, focused on you know making my team the best as we can be and trying to win state. Perfect. Again, that is new 2024 five, uh, five star Mike Matthews here with Adam Gorney for Rivals.